What's going on? It's your boy, Sauce Twins, out here. Too tall, oh my god, too short. Hey, check my boy's shoe game out now. You ain't never seen nothing like this. Alright? So, today, Footwork Friday, this is gonna be for our DBs, LBs, safeties. We get licks and picks, but we gotta be able to move to do that. Alright? So, we got two hexes out here, we got two cones. We'll start in a good athletic position. From there, working nice fluid hips, we are going to work a crossover run, sticking the right foot into the hex, dropping our hips. From there, not spending too much time in the hex, we're going to push out, attack the other hex, dropping our hips, getting that left foot in, coming back, attacking the hex. But once we get to that cone, we are going to reverse pivot. Opening the hips, turning. We're going to get around the cone as fast as we can on the cones, all right? Make sure we get on top of the cone. Make sure to get around. We are dropping our hips, not stopping our feet. And our head and eyes and our knee needs to go in the direction that we want to go, all right? So the faster we can get our head around, the harder we can throw that elbow, the smoother our hips are going to be. Once again, like we talked about last time, everything doesn't have to be full speed, all right? Going a thousand miles an hour. Whenever we're doing this type of footwork, we want good body control. We want everything to be nice and smooth and all of our steps need to be strong, all right? Um, so this is what we have for you today for our Footwork Friday. Let's see this thing in live action. Good crossover, he sticks, gets out, drops his hips, good turn, gets around the cone, finishes through. All right? Hey, if you wanna be an elite DB, elite linebacker, elite safety, we gotta be able to move, gotta have sweet feet, gotta have good hips. If you don't have good hips, you out of there. All right? Till next time. Hey. What will you sacrifice to be great?